So guys, what's going on? Manny Pacquiao. Um, a lot of you think that Manny Pacquiao has gone, uh, gone old. Um, there's still a lot of life left in the old dog yet. Um, someone asked me as well, do you think Manny Pacquiao is, is going to get old overnight? Uh, Manny Pacquiao still got it. He's still got the hunger. He's still got the desire. He's still got the determination. And that's why he's still fighting. Yes, he may be fighting because he wants to, you know, end his career on a good note. He wants to make a few quid. Of course, every fighter does. But I still think Manny Pacquiao has got the hunger and desire to succeed. I still think he's got the determination. I still think he's got what it takes uh, to perform at this level. And not just perform, but succeed at this level. Uh, I think, you know, Manny Pacquiao is somebody that can't be written off. Because he's a very, very determined fighter he's a guy that's lived the life he's 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 his whole life has been boxing and that's why he's reached a level he's reached that's why he's had the success he's had in the sport in a sport that's a very hard sport it's not a sport where you can cut corners because you'll get found out in the ring when you go inside that ring you will be found out if you've been cutting corners and Pacquiao doesn't cut corners and that's why Pacquiao has been able to become an eight division world champion. That's why he's able to he's, a, he's been able to beat so many top fighters because Manny Pacquiao is a guy that never cuts corners. He's a guy that really trains hard. He dedicates himself to the sport, and that's why he's able been able to achieve what he's what he's achieved in the sport. Um, in terms of him getting old, listen, he is forty years of age. I don't. I still think he's got it, um, but he is forty years of age. He is a guy that, you know, is on is at the twilight of his career. He's at the end of his career. So we don't know how he's going to perform against a young, hungry lion that's very skillful in Keith Thurman. You know, we just don't know. It, we, it may just be a case where Manny Pacquiao may still have it and he may just go and school Keith Thurman. Or it may be a case where Manny Pacquiao is old and he doesn't have the movement, he's slow and Thurman's uh, punches have a massive effect on him and he gets stopped. Anything can happen in this fight. You know, we may it may, it may start and... And Pacquiao might just not look the same fight. He might just look a shadow of himself and Thurman may just batter him. We just don't know. Or maybe Pacquiao still got it and Pacquiao batters the crap out of Thurman. We just don't know. This is why I said that this fight is so intriguing and the fight's happening at the right point of these guys' careers because we want to know if Manny Pacquiao is still an elite level welterweight where he can compete with these guys and beat these guys. And we want to see whether Thurman is able to reach the top again. We want to see if Thurman's able to fight the elite guys as well because Thurman came back from injury. Thurman was, you know, Thurman in his last fight didn't look too good. Thurman looked like he was, you know, he, he was all over the place against Josecito Lopez. Now, he's obviously stepping up and fighting a guy that's better than Josecito Lopez and we want to see how he does against somebody like that. Was his last fight just because he hadn't fought for so long and he was taking, he was getting the rust off or is it a case where that, you know, um, Keith Thurman is over the hill and not the fighter he was. So that's why he struggled against Jose Tito Lopez. All questions will be answered on July 20th. This is a massive fight for both guys. It's an important fight for both guys. Um, who's going to come out on top? We'll find out. We've only got, we've got less than a week now. Uh, you know, we've been talking about this fight for a very long time, but it's here now. But I don't think Manny Pacquiao's lost a step. If you want my, uh, uh, my opinion, I still think the guy's got it. I still think the guy's... Uh, got enough to compete at this level. Uh, I saw that against Broner. Uh, but again, you know, until he fights Keith Thurman, we won't be able to make a conclusive uh, judgment. We won't be able to make um, a judgment until he actually fights someone like Keith Thurman because I think Manny Pacquiao hasn't fought an, this level of opponent for a very long time. I think Keith Thurman did his toughest test probably since Floyd Mayweather. Technically, I think Thurman is very, very good. So I think Manny Pacquiao is going to be tested here. Um, we are going to see whether this 41-year-old man still is able to compete with the top dogs because we know if he loses against them and then, you know, Spence and Crawford are way out of reach. Um, uh, if he is able to win, then, you know, we, we, we may see those fights. So there's a lot of questions to be answered and they will be all answered July 20th. Leave your thoughts, guys. Let me know what you think. And guys, remember to please like, share and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.